Hello everybody, JMTV here for uh, my first Let's Play attempt for now. This is Kirby Superstar Ultra. And I'm sorry if the sound is really funny right now. I'll fix that uh, actually right now. Okay. Basically we're just we're just gonna need to go over here. Just the sound settings. So that it's on stereo instead of mono. Okay, everyone, I, uh, sorry about that. I had to make a little cut for, uh, reason. But anyway, though, yeah, unfortunately, I, you only gonna be able to see the top screen. I'll see if I can find a way to incorporate the bottom screen later, but for now, it's not really necessary. Don't worry. There's trouble in Dreamland. I'll just read the text. King DDD and his soldiers have stolen all of the food in Dreamland. And... yeah. And this is our hero. Kirby, as if you didn't already know that. Yeah, we don't need the little tutorial they would normally give us. Because I am a seasoned Kirby player. And... Yeah, for those of you who don't know how Kirby works, here's what you do. Yeah, you just, you know, you just swallow the enemies and you get their abilities. Well, I guess I didn't show that off very well, actually. Oh yeah, and in this game you can press, I think it's like the Y button, to make them into your little allies over here. And is there anything... Yeah, here we go. Okay, we have to take this Warp Star, which will uh, just send you to a new area. Alright, now um, I think I'll talk about how I'm recording this as soon as we come up on this mini-boss over here. Basically what I'm doing is... Wow, that was fast. What I'm doing is... I'm just, uh... I got no cash GBA. It's an emulator. It's really good. Uh, I was gonna record with the Desmume, but... Sadly, my computer's not up to it at the moment. And anyways, though, basically what I'm doing is... I just got this recording with Cam Studio. And I'm recording the sound with Audacity, which is a free uh, sound recording program, and it's really good. And uh, you can do all sorts of stuff, like you can can uh, edit the pitch in this, like this, and you or like this. Buff no buff no It's uh, pretty awesome. But we better heal up while we'll do over here. Yeah, you're. Hundreds out of separate health energy, but luckily you can make out to uh, you know, fix that up. What the heck was that? Yeah, must be. Yeah, never mind. But this is our first boss, Pathetic Woods. Did I just do that? Yeah, Pathetic Woods. He's pathetic. Uh, may maybe his name is like Wispy Woods or something, but uh, that's not important because. He's dead. Yeah. Not exactly the best boss. But I guess the first, so doesn't matter. And we got the little piece of star, and this is the float islands. I'm gonna drop this. Yeah, yeah, I guess the Pavi Bro Jr. is an okay partner. Yeah. This is uh, it's, it's a bit difficult to focus on gameplay and commentary at the same time. But I'm thinking I'm going to be doing Spring Breeze in one video. And, uh... Probably... The rest of them will be... Maybe... Well, Dynablade I might be able to do uh, one... Like... 15, like... 17 minute video or so. But... Other than that, the rest of them are going to be at least... Two or three videos long. And here we go to... What's-their-face's castle? I don't remember. 
I'm sure it's not important. Yeah, actually, in the original, this is, uh, sort of a remake of Kirby's Dreamland, the original, uh, Kirby game, for the Game Boy, and in that game, actually, it's sort of an interesting, they, um, this was actually not the boss. I believe the Boat Islands was, a limp thing or something. I mean, it, w it was something you, like, fought in the air. But, and in that game, it was actually, you had to go through their old castle, but here you just sort of, just, no, no, wait, Bubbly Clouds is this one. I don't remember who the other one is. Well, never mind. Doesn't matter anyways. And let's do this. There's a really good ability. I, did I just do that? I did. Well, there's a pretty good ability I want to get here anyways, and I believe this is the first area we can get in. And I hope that I it doesn't go, like, too low. My emulator right now is at about... It sort of hops from between 95 to 100. Oh, by the way, something I forgot to mention. Go into the start screen, you can see the powers of your, uh, abilities, because in this game, I believe the original Kirby, Kirby Superstar was the first thing to introduce this, you can have multiple things for your ability, whereas in, like, Kirby's Adventure was just a few of the abilities, like UFO and stuff, here you can do that, and also, you don't lose your ability the first time you get hit, you have to... Uh, why is it I even bother? Oh well, let's go through here. This is still gonna take only like 10 minutes anyways. Not like it matters. Okay, this is our uh, mini-boss here. He's pathetically easy. And I'm actually gonna get my partner to fight for me. Alright, kill him. I said kill him. Ah, oh, there we go. I'm actually gonna get rid of this guy, cause... I think right in the next area there's actually a better partner we can get. And I'm gonna wanna have him for the boss of this, uh... For the boss of Spring Breeze, King DDD, the main one. Because... Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know what button you're supposed to use to actually get out of that. But, whatever. And now let's just go over here and grab that. You don't want to stand on that thing, because you can very easily... That thing will break if you stand on it, and you can very easily fall down. But anyway, though, we could go through here and just fight the boss, but instead we're going to go into the moon. And, uh... Yeah, we can heal up in here, as you can see. I think that's good. Maybe I'll collect one more piece. Uh, there was a one-up up there I missed. Oh well. Could float up to go get it, but nah. Don't feel like it. At least you have unlimited floating in this game. Although there's not too many Kirby games without that besides... Uh, well, I know Kirby's Crystal Shards doesn't have that. Maybe I'll do that someday as a let's play. It's a pretty awesome game. But anyways... That, that is not the point. The point here is that we gotta fight this guy. And this guy is... Well, actually, he's pretty easy. It's just that I'm trying to... Maybe do some commentary here and completely failing at it. That's the reason why I'm not doing so well. And... Yeah, we're gonna just make this guy into a partner, because... That's honestly his main use, I think. He's going to be very helpful for the final boss of this, uh, whatchamacallit, if he can survive. Yeah, I'm just gonna let him do all the work, actually. Ah. Come on, kill him. Come on. Ah, there we go. Okay. And... Do -do 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 -do. Ah, I missed my cue. Oh, well. Yeah, and I am going to be able to do this in one, like, maybe 11 or 12 minute video. 
depending on how long this takes, which really shouldn't take that long. And here we have the most broken ability in the game, just about. The stone ability. Which allows you to avoid pretty much all damage. See? And there, he's dead. Yeah, that's King DDD for you. He can't even defend his own castle. And... Now we... Wait. Why did we even need those? Was it so Kirby could... What? Why couldn't we have just gone to his castle in the first place? They ate all the foods. Probably like thousands of people starved while we were... Uh, I won't question this game's logic. Staff. Your mom. Your family. Uh... I don't know. Yeah, and the credits are just rolling on the bottom the screen. It's uh, pretty boring, actually. Yeah. What are we up to? 11.29. Yeah, I actually have a timer down here. Fantasia comes with him. It's not that great of a reporter, actually, but it'll do. And any like frame skips will be a lot harder to detect in a game like this. Where it's not very intensive on it. See, we're still at like, uh, the lowest we've dropped here is like 93% of our regular speed, so I'm not too worried. But anyway, though, Kirby's doing a little dance for the crowd here, and he's just gonna be like, to be continued. Yeah. I don't think that was there in the original Kirby Superstar because it's only to be continued in this. You can now play Dynablade Gourmet Race and the Great Cave Offensive, which you can't see because they're on the bottom screen. Yep, which we will do in the next video. See you guys then.